Hey guys, Mike Mouse 74 with a video review with Transformers Desert Decimation. This is also a requested review from a good YouTube buddy of mine, Optimus Guy One. Make sure you check out his channel. If you haven't subscribed to him, make sure you guys do. So this is the Transformers Desert Decimation, um, and there you see the unopened package. So as I said in my previous update, um, I got this over at Canadian Tire for $14.99. The regular price was $19.99. Uh, so you get four Legends class figures for $15. Bucks. You, it, you, you get a pretty good deal, you know. If you ask me, that, that's just my opinion. I think one one uh, Legends class figure probably costs you like six bucks. So you get four for like 15. So I'll give you guys a full 360 and show you what they look like all around. So we'll start on the Autobot side before I go into detail with you guys. So over here you have Lessons Class Autobot um, Ironhide. And over here you have Lessons Class Autobot Ratchet. And then come to the Decepticon side, you have Lessons Class Bone Crusher. And then finally you have Lessons Class Decepticon Deep Desert Brawl. So I'll get, give you guys a little bit of a, a little bit of a detail. I actually like this uh, the color scheme on this. Um, it stands out really, really nice with the black and the um, and the bronze colored windows here, and then on the side here, and the other side is, as well. It has the bronze colors, uh, the bronze colored windows. And it has the silver, um, the silver uh, bumper right there. Well, not bumper, but the front. This is the bumper here, so it's a brown color. And then the uh, <clears throat> his guns are painted silver as well. Kind of makes the the vehicle stand out more. And it has four wheels on the bottom here, here, and then there, and then on the other side as well. Um, you can see the Autobot symbol, which will become the chest piece right there. If you guys can see that. So to go ahead and put him in his robot mode, it's actually quite simple. <clears throat> so you want to just just take your time with it, do it nice and slow, so you don't uh, pop off any of the ball joints. So just bring the arm out, the arm piece out like so. Do the same thing with this side. You want to bring it out like so. And then you want to flip this up, or flip this down, sorry, like so. And you want to flip um, Ironhide's head up, just like that. And then you want to bring down the arm. Actually, just unpeg the feet. You don't want to do nothing, just leave them like that. And then you want to rotate um, Ironhide's arm, like so, because you can see it is, a, it is on a ball joint. And then do the same thing with this side. You just want to rotate it so the arm is facing upwards and it is on a ball joint as well. So there's Ironhide in his robot mode, so I'll set him down here to the side. Just back the camera up so you guys can see. And then we'll come to Autobot Ratchet. Uh, similar to the um, Revenge of the Fallen um, Voyager class Ratchet. It has the again the bronze colored windows on the on the front and on the side as well and he is a rescue rescue truck and he has the uh, the red stripe along the side same with the other side it has the red stripe just like the um, Voyager class from the Revenge of the Fallen line and he has the, the black wheels So to go ahead and transform him, it's pretty simple as well. You just take the arms out like so, and just leave it, leave the arms where they are, just like that. And then do the same thing with this one. You want to un unpeg it, and then just bring the arms out like so. And then you want to take take the legs and bring the legs down like that, and then lock it in place. 
do the same thing. With this side, you want to just lock it in place. And then <clears throat> lastly, you just want to rotate the whole midsection of uh, ratchet body. And then just like so, and then just kind of tuck it in like that. And then there you, there you have Ratchet in his robot mode. And I'll put him down here. Give me a second here, sorry. And just, I had the foot down, so you just wanna make sure the foot's lined up at the, on the bottom. And just, just put him down here. And then from the Decepticon side, um, Legends Class Bone Crusher. Um, I, like, I like this vehicle, it looks pretty neat. A, 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 um, a beige colored vehicle with a huge fork <laughs> on the top of the truck uh, and you have the windows that are black here pretty cool figure all around so to go ahead and transform him you just kind of want to move this out of the way just kind of set that down for a minute um, and then you want to just bring the feet down like so and then you want to unpeg his arms like so because it'll reveal his face like that and then just kind of just bring that part down and then do the same thing bring his other arm down like so and then you have um, bone crusher in his robot mode and finally we come to <clears throat> legends class Decepticon Deep Desert Brawl, pretty cool tank. It has it's a yellow tank with a little bit of um, brown on it along the side here, and then it has a uh, a nice Decepticon symbol right there, and it has four wheels on the bottom here, here, right, right there, and right there as well. So to go ahead and transform him, you just want to bring bring the uh, the gun, unpeg it, and then bring it down like so. Because these will bring these will these will be his hands, and then like like so. And then you want to bring down the uh, the front, which will be his chest and his head right there. And then you just want to bring that down, for as it'll be his hand, and rotate that down, and then just un. I peg the feet and then bring the feet down like that and then bring the other foot down like so and there you have <clears throat> Deep Desert Brawl in his robot mode and I'll set him down there so I'll just give you a little bit close up on each so there you have Legends class Ironhide in his robot mode looks really really cool. I really like this figure. R really really neat. Very well detailed as well. And then there's Legends class Ratchet, and you can see the Autobot symbol on the chest part. Whoops, sorry about the blurriness. His hands are also molded into the into the plastic, so his Autobot symbol is right there. And then there's Legends Class Decepticon Bone Crusher. See, he has a nice Decepticon symbol on his leg right there. And then lastly, we have um, Legends Class Decepticon Deep Desert Brawl. Pretty cool figure. So I'll give you guys a full 360 on these figures as well. I'm thinking of doing a two part video. I'm really sorry. I know what you guys are thinking, a two part video for a Legends, for four Legends class figures. I wasn't playing on it, but I'm just taking my time with it so I don't screw anything up. And 
in part two, I'll just I'll just go back into the into the vehicle mode. So I do apologize for this. So this is my mouse 74 with the Transformers Desert Decimation um, four pack Legends class figures. And I'll be back in part two. And I'll see you guys later. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, support the mouse, and best of all guys, support our Transformer community. And I'll see you guys later. Take care.